Hello everyone, this is Ella. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a treat for you. We are going shopping for art supplies in New York City together. I am going to CW Pencil Enterprise. This little shop is a little gem. It is on the Lower East Side of Manhattan in the intersection of Canal Street and Orchard Street. The entire store is dedicated to pencils, pencil accessories, notebooks and everything else you can think of that goes along with drawing or writing either with graphite or colored pencils they have amazing selection of things and some very special things like they had this cashmere sweater number two cashmere sweater i mean amazing uh, and it kind of has that yellow pencil look it, it's just beautiful I did ask for permission to record inside the store, just so you know. There were people waiting outside because of COVID procedures. No more than three people could be inside the store. So it was quite calm. And I did have to do that a bit quick so that other people could get inside the store. So just showing you more of the stuff they have. They had this really cool like squared mini colored pencil set that was just like adorable. And especially the fact that it was inside an acrylic box, like it just made it extra special. They had this crazy Caran d'Ache $250 pencil sharpener, which is supposed to be like the best pencil sharpener ever. They have a great selection of notebooks and sketchbooks, and they have pencils for from different countries. They have a big selection of Japanese pencils, European pencils, and American pencils. It's the holiday season when I was recording this and they had this super cute little pencil village and I just thought that was kind of adorable so I had to show you. They had a variety of mini supplies and big supplies and erasers and uh, pencil sharpeners. All the pencil sharpeners that I saw here were manual. I wonder if there's a reason for that. I didn't see any automatic pencil sharpeners. I guess they're more gentle on the pencils and if you're gonna spend money on like very special pencils you want them to last for a very long time they even had a number two fragrance so basically a perfume and they had charms kind of like necklaces with little pencils which were great one of the things i loved the most about the store were the sample sets they had these sample sets for about 12 dollars each and they were picked by the staff and they had different themes so I just thought that was a great idea for a little gift and just to try out different types of pencils in addition to the sample sets they had some gift sets that included notebooks erasers and sharpeners inside of different themes as well so I actually got one for myself and I can't wait to unbox it with you so at the end of this video I'm gonna open my gift set and show you what I got and finally they had a Caran d'Ache bar at the back of the store where you can try out the entire range of super colored to watercolor pencils and it was just amazing it's just delicious to look at and super fun to try out all the pencils here so i'm back home now with the gift set that i got as cw pencil and i'm so excited to try it and open it and just see what's inside because I didn't really look at it too well at the pictures, so I, I know there's a notebook, a pencil, and maybe a pencil sharpener. I'm not sure, so we'll see. I didn't really read the description too well because I want it to be a bit of a surprise. Look at this packaging. It is isn't it beautiful. Oh my god, they have like a number two pencil ribbon that says CWPE or CW Pencil. That's just adorable. This gift set was about $12, which is quite affordable and I think a great gift for somebody who likes office supplies or art supplies. They use black washi tape and this kind of composition notebook wrapping paper, which I think is super, super fun. They did a great job with just the wrapping and the packaging. It just looks like such a nice gift so it's like early christmas for me all right so there's a little box inside oh there's a note let's see what it says from our shop in new york city to your home we hope you'll enjoy a few of our favorite things a kukuyo sketchbook a total icon in japan this slim little notebook was first introduced in 1959 
as a sokuru, sokuryo yako, which translates to surveying field book. Traditionally, they are used by engineers to record measurements in the field, but in the past 60 years, they've grown a vast cult following. It's a remarkable thin notebook, only a quarter of an inch thick, and has a hard, sturdy cover. We consider it the original pocket notebook. Oh my god, that is so funny. It's funny because I'm originally an engineer, so this is like super great. Oh, it's a grid paper. Oh, that is so cool. I love it. I haven't used grid paper since I was in engineering school. Oh, this is beautiful. So exciting. The next item is a Viarco Diseño Pencil. It means drawing in Portuguese, but we really like this pencil for general use just as much. Viarco is a Portugal's one and only pencil factory. Oh, that's so cool. Founded in 1907, Viarco has done a beautiful job of preserving and sharing their Portuguese heritage while also constantly innovating unique new things. They are very much a 21st century pencil company. Portuguese pencil. What a nice packaging. Look at this. This is so cool. It says, Viarco, a quality pencil for all kinds of uses. They even have a little seal and they're from Madeira in Portugal. That is super cool. Let me take it out of the packaging. Just a number two pencil. It doesn't have an eraser. So interesting. I'm actually try it out in the sketchbook just to see. Oh, cool. It writes really well. That's really cool. And just the simplicity of it and how kind of vintage and retro this looks, I just love it. It's so cool. And then the next item is Cum Wood Cutter Sharpener, a simple utilitarian classic that's equipped for all normal diameter pencils made in Germany. And look at this little envelope with a CW Pencil 2020 sticker. So cute. Oh, cool. So it's like actually a wooden pencil sharpener. That's awesome. I love it. I love my little gift set. I mean, this would be a great gift for anybody that loves these kind of things. I really hope you enjoyed this trip with me and doing a little window shopping in New York. It's always exciting for me during the holidays. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more. Let me know in the comments below if you like this type of video, like going around and shopping and looking at supplies and different things. If you do, or if you want to see other types of videos, I would like to hear what you have to say. All right. Well, I'll see you in my next video. Take care.